Sleep, one of the most important aspects of our life that helps us stay on top of our health and well-being. And with so many of us waking up now as early as 4am and up to 5.30am to win our morning and win our day by getting steps in and our training, we just do whatever we need to to get on top of the day before everyone's awake. It creates a lot of controversy for those who like to have a lie-in, go to bed a little bit later. And for those who do like to have a lie-in or go to bed a little bit later, they say we're bad. They say, you wake up early and they're knackered. They're knackered by six, seven o'clock. But of course you're going to be tired. That's common sense. Because if you're waking up early, then you're going to get tired earlier. If you're waking up two hours early in the day, then you're going to need to wind down two hours, two hours early in the day. And probably going to sleep two hours earlier to make sure you get between seven and eight hours sleep. Again, that's just common sense. And that's part of our circadian rhythm. We're going to bring everything forward then that means that we have to bring our sleep forward or wind down forward. But again, we're still getting up nice and early. We're attacking our day, getting ahead of everyone else, doing things nice and fresh, being ahead in the game and winning. That's the main thing to remember.